It's been two years since a Twin Cities man disappeared in the Namaji Forest south of Duluth while deer hunting. His family is still looking for answers. CBS 3's Natalie Grant shares their message to other hunters as they enter the woods this weekend. Two years ago, Lee Peltier and a small group ventured out into the Namaji Forest in Pine County for the deer hunting opener. I think they intentionally separated. Um, one was going to go down below and like one up on a ridge and flush out any deer that happened to be down by the pond and he was never seen again. Since his disappearance in 2018, Lee's family has been working with volunteers and local police to try to piece together what happened that day. Searching for the last couple of years and we haven't found anything, no clue, no um, rifle, no boots, no cell phone, nothing. The Dimaggi Forest spans more than 90,000 acres, and without any indications of Lee's whereabouts, it makes finding him that much more difficult. So without knowing which direction to look, it's kind of been impossible. It's a needle in a haystack, literally. With the Minnesota deer opener just days away, Megan and her family are asking hunters to keep an eye out for anything unusual. Maybe just even on the lookout for anything colorful that sticks out to you in the woods or just be aware of, you know, if you're stumbling upon anything under your feet, um, just, just to know that something's out there and any clue we can get would be amazing. Hoping to take advantage of the warmer temperatures and bring him home before the snow covers the ground again. Megan says her dad was wearing an orange jacket, camel pants, and was carrying a rifle that day. We reached out to the Pine County Sheriff's Office today for an update on this case. They say the investigation is still open and they are taking any tips that come their way.